I found little pictures of dogs, and since my little girl is so into dogs, we turned this into a game. It was actually from an old book, and once again, I cut it out and made it like a little puzzle game. Now here, she has to compare sizes. Now if you don't have all these in the same book, it's fine. You can pick dogs, pictures of dogs, pictures of flowers, the different heights, dogs, different lengths, pencils, or pictures, or even real things. And they just have to put it, compare the sizes, and put it from the biggest to the smallest. And then you try again, you mix them all up, and then you try from the smallest to the biggest. So I find that if it's something, an object, or an animal, or food that they really like, they really get into the game. So try to pay attention to those favorites of your little ones and they'll really enjoy the games that you play with them or the little things that you make for their learning and school.